Ramblers up here. Who am I going to start with? Oh, here on the lake. Hey, that's me. <laughs> <laughs> that was the one that was going to be the last one. I'm excited to be here. I'm not responsible for anything this man says. Why? Oh, his name. He's going to try to say that. Huh. Yeah. They know you. I don't have to explain. We go off on some trips. We go off the big band, would you? We have been all over the United States. We've been all, this past year, we've been to Missouri, Missouri two, two times, to Florida. Yeah. We went to Alabama. <laughs> they may never let us come back to Alabama. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it was because of me. I guarantee you. They won't let us go back to Missouri much about either. Yeah, I tell you, they, 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 uh, they, 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 they don't everybody around know this guy like y'all do. So I, I probably don't have to explain to him today, but a lot of times I have to kind of explain away some of the stuff he might say or do. But uh, he does a fine job on the base. He really does. And he is a fine fellow. He would do anything in the world for you. <laughs> yeah. yeah, that's all right. You pay me later. And uh, he comes from the town of Independence, Louisiana, from the legendary Cooksey family of Bluegrass Gospel Music. That's the voice, Kevin. Over here on the five string banjo. And the award goes to. <laughs> Are we ready for that? No, not yet. <laughs> I, hope, I hope you get it on Mandolin. Well, thank you. Yeah. <laughs> Well, that's fine. Now, y'all know this fellow, don't you? Anybody here not know him? Oh, my goodness. Let me tell y'all about him. Man, he's the banjo picker, this banjo picker, whatever. Pick the banjo. Yeah. I'm getting better at that, Larry. I've been practicing. Makes his home up around Starkville, Mississippi, by way of Brookhaven. He's originally from Brookhaven, Mississippi. And I think he's got some hometown folks here tonight. And... Uh, Ten-year veteran of Mr. Jimmy Martin's Sunday Mountain Boys. Woo, just can't say enough good things about him. Mr. Larry Wallace. Y'all thank him much. <laughs> Over here on the flat top marching buddy, I tell you, he's picking cotton two girls at a time. <laughs> Can I drag him? This fella here has been running the roads with me for almost two years. Now, y'all, that may not sound like much, but it feels like 20, don't it? Yeah, he's my guitar player of the year. Yeah. <laughs> All he is, he is, not only is he a fine man, and a fine guitar player, and a fine singer. Alan, he's my guitar player of the year. <laughs> and uh, he, is, he is road and broke. I tell you what, and he's hung in there with me. If he was going to quit, I think he'd have done it by now. And I'm so proud he's in here today playing that Martin guitar all the way from Philadelphia, Mississippi, the Shoba County, born and raised all the way, Mr. Butch Hodges. Y'all make me laugh. I'll tell you what, somebody said, well, it's about time they got a man and a player in that band. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> but it's true, it's true. Now, y'all met the kids, uh, Southern Flair, Mr. Patrick, and uh, the Goins sisters, and Mr. Anthony. That, they're some of my students, and this one here is, too. I'm proud of her, and uh, she's going to be guesting on the program with us here today. Make sure home up in where, Mississippi? Yeah. I call her Tater Bug. Yeah. This is Mick, Miss Alexis Taterbug Turnipseed. Yeah, y'all give her a big one. <laughs> and my name is Phil Allen Sibley. I tell you, we'll, uh, hey, how about a, a banjo team right there, Larry? Something like uh, maybe the Uncloudy Day. You can do it right there in there. Yeah.